We all know that the paracord bracelet are often used in a survival situation. So here is one of those bracelets. You can use it outside and in the wilderness, but you can use it also in a real life. So when you head for a town or for a club, go out or you're somewhere in a city in a stranger neighborhood and you certainly get into a situation that is life threatening and you need to uh, stand for yourself, you will need to have some defensive tool, am I right? And the, exactly the tool that you need is this bracelet. You wear it like a usual paracord bracelet and when the situation happens you just take it off insert it into your hand like you can see and it will be the great boxer sorry about this message and it will be the great boxer tool as you can see there are lots of screws or sorry nuts and it's very firm so when you hit it and you smash it it will give the results as you do it. <coughs> It will give the results and the chance you to escape or evade the future attacks. So if you want to know how to make this bracelet, please stay tuned because tutorial is right in a 3, 2, go. Hello boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, Madame Monsieur. And welcome back to the Alpha 1982 YouTube family. My name is Dale, and today we're gonna make the beautiful paracord bracelet, as you saw, called the Hex Nut Paracord Bracelet. For this bracelet, we're gonna need total length of 12 feet of this paracord 550, or in the metric measurements, 4 meters. This paracord buckle, uh, 3 eighths of an inch, and this Hex Nut, uh, I have here two different sizes. Uh, because I want to experiment uh, in the original design done by Kevin House he did with the uh, all the same size of the hex nuts I will as I said experiment a bit and put this bigger one in the middle and these small ones uh, on the sides of bracelet so let's start first take the ends of a cord and make it uh, a bit round so it will be easier for you to input them into the hex nuts so we're gonna insert from the top to the bottom and here we have the basic cow hitch and we're done the first part of the bracelet. The important thing here is that you pay attention to these lines, left should be left, right should be right, and when you inserting the hex nut it should stay that way. here it should be enough so I will put the hex nut here 
and it will be the boundary. Now here the important thing is that this hex nut on the left side here is my boundary and the point where the actual bracelet should end. Now when we secure this here, take the ends here and make it through. So when we're going through we're gonna need to insert the hex nut in. Make the loops here like this and then take the right side right strand and you're gonna insert it through this loop here on the right side like this and left one through this left loop here on the beginning is tough because you have lots of cartridge and the first hex nut is always tough to secure but you'll see by the way you reach the half of the bracelet you will master this technique so take it pull it up like this and then simply Just rearrange a bit so this will be okay to leading oh and this is enough now take the other side and tighten it up secure it well and now from here you will take the right side on top and under and through here like this and you'll tie this up like this and with the left side also on top under and through the loop here and tie it and firmly secure like this okay now again start from the beginning under those two in the middle or through the middle sorry and then insert the another hex nut through Guys, if you have any questions about this bracelet or any other, or any other paracord project, please leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe, because we have two new projects every week. And give a thumb up if you like this, and you want to support me and my work with the paracord. Now, when you insert the another hex nut, you're gonna simply turn it up, but make it almost until to touch this next one here. So take it and here make a little loop 
take the right side cord and then insert it through like this and now pull it and that's it we need to rearrange this one like this okay and this one right side through sorry left side the left strand this strand through the left loop here
So guys, I hope that you like this this video. Please do support my work. Uh, subscribe, give a thumb like. <laughs> Sorry. Subscribe, give a thumb up. Share with your friends and the family and leave some comments in the comment section down below. Say what you think about this bracelet, this channel or suggest what I should improve or which project do you want me to do next and what is your opinion about all uh, Paracord projects and my channel in global. I very really appreciate your support, big thanks to my uh, subscribers and of course the viewers the viewers without you I wouldn't be here and I will probably continue making the bracelets without to make these tutorials I hope I help uh, you guys to achieve something that you wanted with the paracord projects and I also wish you uh, all the best in the future projects you have uh, you can leave in the comment section the project you done by yourself or share the pictures or maybe a link to your video with the project or a content of paracord you work it on and finished and as I like to say voila now Let's cut the excess of a cord, melt it down and we're gonna talk about the improvement of the bracelet by adding a one more color. Please share it with your friends and the family, subscribe, support us, give a thumb up and leave a comment, tell us what you think about this beautiful paracord bracelet. And that's what we all for today, thanks for watching, appreciate your time and support, wishing you just best. See you in the next tutorial, until then, bye!